This is prone hip cars. I'm going to try and explain as best I can uh, before the sound gets too muffled. Uh, while I, so you have to lay on your stomach for this. You do have to take your time. If you do not take your time with this, it will not accomplish what we're trying to do here, okay? You have three things you're trying to, um, it's, it's, it's a hip mobility drill. Three things that we have to do. Number one, bend the knee. Simple enough, right? Number two, lift the knee. Simple enough. Three, bring the knee out to the side while externally rotating your hip and relax. Then you gotta reverse that, okay? So, I'm gonna lay on my stomach. I'm gonna try and keep it where you can still hear this, but normally I have my people like lay all the way down, but because of this, I'm gonna keep my head up, but normally I'll have them lay all the way down with their arms out like this or out to the sides just to help because if you do this correctly, it is extremely hard. I repeat this, if it's done correctly, you will know that you did it correctly because it is extremely hard. You may feel like you're gonna cramp, especially in the outside of the hip there, okay? So, we're gonna be here. What I say first was bend the knee, all right? Then, while you continue to keep the knee bent, you're gonna lift the knee. Then, externally rotate the hip, bringing the knee out to the side. Let it rest a second, lift the knee, bring it back, down with the knee, down with the leg. Then repeat. I'm working over here making this really, really, I'm not making this hard, it is hard. All right? Some people only get their knee to here. Some people need to get their knee to here. Whatever you can get, the big thing is, is I don't want, as you're doing this, for you to be able, like out here and you lift the hip up to get it like that. We need this hip to stay close to the ground while we do it, which allows for us to actually get mobility itself at the hip. And those are prone hip cars. Take your time, all right?